how to get your article published in Nature or Science. Getting your thorough research article published in the prestigious magazines Nature or Science is every researcher's dream. Only the best articles make it, and the competition is huge. When others start quoting from your work, well, then you've really made it. Very often people forget what I think is the one of the most important things about doing science, which is how to pose the question that you're interested in trying to answer. And in some ways that may seem self-evident, but very often the way that the question is posed ends up producing or not producing a critical result. What do you need? A good or new topic that's relevant, perseverance, and people who are willing to help you. Step one, try to hook up with an established research group which already has high impact publications to its name. Step two, be selective in your research topic. The more innovative or the bigger the general interest, the greater the chance you stand of getting published. Step three, not every institute allows its students or PhDs to publish under their own names. What good does it do you to help promote your professor's reputation by being co-author? It's about you. Erasmus MC encourages its students to step into the limelight. That will get you somewhere. Step four, do you need to have a connection with the editors of these magazines? It's important that your promoter uh, your supervisor is experienced in writing articles in Cell Nature, New England, etc. And we have those people aboard here in Erasmus MC. They do it on average 40 times a year. A good research institute such as Erasmus MC will teach you during your research master how to get published. It's a place where I think Erasmus really shines because there's such a broad base of experienced mentors who you can go to and talk to as you're developing your question, as you're developing your project, to try to understand what are the critical aspects in order to pose a question right so that when you go through your experiments, you have the potential to have a very high impact result that 30, 40, 50 years from now, people are still going to read that paper and say, that study has informed us in a very meaningful way. And that's the way forward, I think, to high impact papers. Graduate School Erasmus Medical Center, from knowing to growing.